but it does take a very dyspeptic view of investments because they prioritize tax cuts for billionaires over investments. They purport or pretend or actually will cut out all federal investment in roads, bridges, highways, and transit. $52 billion cut. That's a couple of million jobs and a lot more crumbling bridges. We have something called the Land Water Conservation Fund. It's funded by taxes collected from offshore oil drilling. It's supposed to buy conservation lands. They will not allow a single acre of land to be purchased by the federal government, but they'll still collect the tax from the oil industry. And then what about the looming crisis and wildfires in the West? Well, they've closed their eyes and they're pretending we're not going to have drastic wildfires across the West, and they put zero budget in there in anticipation of drastic wildfires. This is the most, I just unbelievably unrealistic and you know, I, I would have to go almost to the word, and I can't attribute it to people's motivations, but hypocritical budget I've ever seen. Gentleman's time has expired. Gentleman from Wisconsin. At this time, I'd like to yield two minutes to a member of the Budget Committee, the gentleman from Wisconsin.